It's a great tragedy for the nation. One problem is that there's fewer and fewer general election districts that really are competitive in a fundamental sense. Incumbents get re-elected at 96 percent. We made calls in 87 percent of races with 100 percent accuracy. That just shows how locked up most of the House is. It's really only about the primary election. The political safety is at the base. And that explains the lack of compromise that you see in Congress because there's no incentive when members represent only the like-minded. Nothing being done that would actually move us towards resolution of long-term problems. I want people to work together. I, that's, my, that's always been Boy, my role. Good luck on that my one role. In Washington. Well, I mean, you have to work at it. I, I was the oldest in my freshman class out of 50. Uh, I wear that with a badge of honor. I don't look at things in Republican, re, uh, Democrat, Independent. I look at things in, in value. You were a guy who was a, a maverick in the, in the Arizona House and Senate. I mean, you, you were a Republican and your own Republican folks didn't think you were conservative enough. Right, and, and I'm sure there might be some liberals that uh, think I'm not liberal enough. Compromise is a big, big deal. None of us are sworn in office to, to get reelected. We're sworn in office to help people. You need to have this competitive process out there be able to find and discuss the issues, but also find the person that's going to best meet those needs of the district.